I've been waiting for you to come out and play. What took you so long? <laughs> who you calling a clown? You don't know who you're messing with. <laughs> you made a big mistake coming over here. I'll give you a three second head start to get lost. One, two, three. I've been waiting for you to come out and play. What took you so long? <laughs> Hello everybody, and today we get a new prep, and welcome to Yo-Yo Gaming, first of all. According to Nightmare's Corner for the the little intro scene, I will put that in the title, though, Johnny Punk, to, like, dash, but... Maybe, uh, but I'll most likely put it in the, the description, so, yeah. First of all, credit to Nightmare's Corner. He's a pretty cool dude, um, he does little in-store things. So, first of all, I'm gonna do my review on Johnny Punk. Um, you guys know as the worst prop from Spirit to you guys. The wheelchair granny is a lot worse to me. Like I, I think the wheelchair granny is a lot worse. I mean, wheelchair granny is kind of okay, I guess you could say, but the price of it was expensive. But this prop, I think he is well placed, like at the price. I know a lot of you guys are like, <laughs> Ugh, this guy sucks, it's not worth it. But no, I think he, no, for the max and stuff like that, and just turning off the audio or changing it, 160 isn't bad. Though, yeah, people were saying that he does not swing. He probably does in person. He probably does swing, but if he doesn't, that would be kind of stupid. Because he should be able to swing, because the person, people that made this is not seeing no visions like people rumored. Before it's made by the people that make the static swing props, and I hope they do make the swing. And if it doesn't, then what's the point of the swing? What I wish it would be, uh, what I thought could have been better about this prop. Let's talk about it. Okay, 4.5 feet, not that tall. Uh, before he was seven feet, which a lot of people were like, "What the." F Big. The seven feet is also the ropes on the swing. A lot of people got that mistaken, but the ropes on the swing is uh, seven feet tall and through the legs, but they kind of changed it because a lot of people were confused, so it went to 4.5 feet, which that's the actual kid's uh, height, so. Let's get to the the good parts of the scepter. I mean, not scepter, um, prop. First off, really great design really great design uh, I like the design I mean the red hoodie I think kind of ruins it but I think it would look better with just a clown suit like a vintage clown suit and I think that would have been cool the vintage clown mask is awesome first of all I want it to be something like the um, related to like Michael Myers or something like that vintage Michael Myers like when he's a kid I thought that could have been cool, or something like that, and him just standing, and you could just hear breathing sounds. I thought that could have been cool, but, yeah, I think that could have been better, but, yeah, the pro on this one is the design is kind of cool, but the things I have on this one, first of all, the, the, the ropes actually go through the palm of the hand, kind of, and I hate that design, like, I don't like it. I don't like how it's well done like that. Like I wish it just went through, you know, like the holes of the hand, like where the where it's holding it, because that because that's like really easy to do, but they kind of mistaken it. So and also barely swings. First of all, that's one thing. And also, of course, the thing I hate most, the voice. And yeah, the voice sucks. First of all, um, I, you guys know the voice already because I already send it. I put it in the intro. Not only that, you know. So, he is sitting at 160, which is not a bad price to me. Shut the frig up. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm getting a lot of notifications right now, so. Yeah. Um, not a bad prop. Probably not something. I'm, I'm totally not gonna buy this thing, and a lot of people aren't, but. I can see how some people like him. I think, like, what I would do if I bought him, I would buy him. Keep him like static or something like that, or turn off the audio, or just add another audio. Audio that would sound better to me because I do not want that freaking one, two, three. You know that punk type voice, like 
you don't know who you're messing with. <laughs> yeah, I, 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 yeah, I can see H T J Halloween. Ha ha. But no, it's not. It's not H T J Halloween because it because I think the person that voiced this sounds like younger. It's T J Halloween, so no. So yeah, it's totally not me. It's totally not me. I'm. I have a deeper voice than this freaking punk. <laughs> So yeah, yeah, I really, really like the design, I like how what they're going for, but just the voice just sucks. And I'm pretty sure a lot of people hate the voice, but some people also out there like don't like the voice, but they also hate the design, which I highly disagree with them. I like the design of it, but as you can see in the description, Johnny's bad, there's no good reason. No story about a broken home or a deadbeat. <laughs> that he's got a nice house, loving parents, and severe attitude problems. You can usually find him swinging at the local playground and making all ki the kids and their parents a bit worried about what happens when Johnny decides to get up from that swing. But don't worry, his bark is worse than his bite for now. Johnny Punk rocks back and forth on his swing while taunting his onlookers with bratty phrases. Who are you calling a clown? You don't know who you're messing with. <laughs> I've been waiting for you to come out and play. What took you so long? You made a big mistake coming over here. I'll give you a three second oh I'll give you a three second head start. Get lost. One, two, three. That was the original line, but for some, I'll give you the count of three. I'll give you a three-second head start. It does not sound like that. I, I guess that was like the old line, but it's, it's. I'll give you a three-second head start. Get lost. One, two, three. So yeah. So he's four point five feet and five seven feet from. Yeah. See, seven feet. There you go. So yeah, a lot of people were confused about that this part, but yeah. He's not a bad prop, um, he's your one, which means he is going to stores, he is going to stores, people. He's going to stores, and... Yeah. Do like him, do like him, do like him. Besides the voice. <laughs> so yeah, it is made by W. Whoa, whoa, I don't know how to say it. But you guys know the people that make static swinging props and stuff like that, they are making another swinging prop that I'm not going to say because it is not out yet, but yeah. Okay. I'm sorry. Um. So yeah, the reason why a lot of you guys are asking why I'm making longer videos trying to get those longer videos out because I have been making short freaking videos. Let's try to make those longer videos rolling, guys. And every time a sneak peek comes out, it's always gonna be a review, sadly. So it's not gonna be like I just upload a sneak peek, that's it. But yeah. Hope you guys really enjoyed this video, first of all. This video was really fun to make and stuff like that, I guess. <laughs> but yeah, the the editing is going to be freaking awful in this video because I'm going to have to edit that intro scene. So, yeah. Uh, <laughs> ah, so, yeah. Okay, that's basically it. So, 4.5 Johnny Punk animatronic decorations from Spirit Halloween. 91 days until Halloween. I'm saying random stuff right now, but... Is he a bad prop? Without the audio, no. With the audio, yes. Uh, he is the worst prop from Spirit. No, I'm just kidding. He's not. I think Realtor Granny is a lot worse, but... Yeah, I just wish he could have been better, you know? He could have been better. But... That's all we got today! <laughs> so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Bye, bye guys. Peace out.